Works Racing makes engine parts for treasured Norton motorcycles from the 1950s and 60s. The company was founded and started three years ago by Patrick Walker. Its factory is actually a modest wooden shed next to the home he shares with his family and two dogs near Stratford-upon-Avon in England. Modest it may be, but the precision parts made in the Works Racing shed are shipped to Norton owners all over the world. When the weather is fine, Mr. Walker throws open the double door of his south-facing workplace and sunshine illuminates a curiosity shop of engines, motorcycle memorabilia and a Haas Mini Mill 2. So the decision to start Works Racing I think was in, taken in 2008 at Goodwood, probably as a result of too much champagne. And myself and my business partner Miles Robinson uh, sat down and decided that we would manufacture our own um, 86mm bore 500cc Manx Norton engines. Uh, the first stage of that process was for me to sit down and design the complete engine in SolidWorks 3D CAD. That took about um, six months hard work I suppose and it was, it was hard work because I started that process as being competent but not an expert CAD modeler. I ended up being pretty expert and there are a lot of parts and those, the parts that I was modelling are not uh, easy geometric shapes. Because it's an old engine, it was produced originally using wooden patterns, and obviously some of the shapes involved in those are, are made by hand. And uh, the next phase, the second phase, having designed the engine, was to decide how we were going to produce it. And uh, it was really only quite uh, late in that process that we looked at the option of purchasing our own machine and manufacturing the parts ourselves. Because at that stage, we started talking to Haas and ended up buying uh, a Mini Mill 2. Having taken delivery of the Haas, the first thing I needed to do was learn how to use it. But it turned out to be a remarkably simple process. The machine is, is so intuitive to use. And when linked with the, the CAM software I was using, I was able to produce uh, all of my jigs and fixtures and a full set, one engine set of castings in eight weeks from, from the start. So the way I produce these castings is quite unusual. Instead of machining a batch, which would be the, the normal method of maybe 10 or 20 parts, I actually produce everything as a one-off, one engine set of everything to the customer's specification that engine then gets built and shipped. The bike we produce is aimed squarely at competitive racing. Uh, our customers tend to be uh, maybe in their 30s or 40s or even 50s and 60s, some of them, but they are racers through and through and they want to win races. So it's vitally important that our engine has more power than the competition. <laughs> 